This story is why I don't go spelunking. On November 24, 2009, John Jones and 10 of his family and friends decided to explore Nutty Putty Cave as a way to bond before Thanksgiving. Nutty Putty Cave is southwest of Utah Lake and about 55 miles from Salt Lake City. John went in at around 8pm, and after an hour, he decided to crawl through an extremely tight passage called the Birth Canal. He crawled in head first, moving forward with his hips and fingers, but quickly realized he was in trouble. John tried to squeeze through an opening that was barely 10 inches across and 18 inches tall, and when he let out a breath, he became permanently stuck. His brother found him and tried to pull him out, but John slid down the passage even further, trapping his arms under his chest. After this, he couldn't move at all. John was trapped 400 feet into the cave and 100 feet below the Earth's surface. Over the next 24 hours, more than 100 rescue officers tried to pull John out using a rope and pulley system, but nothing worked. After 27 hours, John died of cardiac arrest. In 2004, the Nutty Putty Cave was closed after two Boy Scouts became trapped, almost losing their lives. Nutty Putty had only been reopened for six months when John and his family entered the cave. A week after John's death, Nutty Putty Cave was officially sealed off for good. John was never recovered, and his body remains sealed inside the cave to this day.